That was a good dinner. Yeah. That chop steak was really freaking good. Man. I'm telling you, even though I don't eat beef, I'm gonna think I'm gonna get it the next time. That's a lot of beef. That's a lot of beef. I mean, with your belching and shit, it always gets worse when you eat red meat. Yeah, you're right. Well, God damn, was a good meal. It was juicy, delicious, it didn't taste cheap. It was probably it? was cheap meat, but not cheap, 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 cheap. I'll bet you it isn't, because I know cheap meat. That wasn't cheap. Can you just level wall off, please? Yep. Uh, Damn, your gas is so sensitive. Yeah, it's very sensitive. When you kick it, you really kick it. See, I think, uh, huh. Well, I got the my car. minivan gas is sensitive. Well, my car, I have the expo turned up so high, they got to really mash the gas down to really go. You got the what turned up so high? In, um, in RC, we call it expo, exponential trim. That's what eco mode does in the car. It basically turns up expo, so, um... Yeah, like if you push the gas pedal 10%, you get 10% throttle. Push it 50%, you get 50% throttle. Well, with Expo, it works on a curve instead of linear. So if I push the gas 20%, I'll get 5% thrust. If I push the gas 50%, I'll get you know 30% thrust. And then as I approach 100%, it ramps up to 100%. But it makes it, a, you have a, a much larger soft zone before you engage full power. So it makes it easier to feather the throttle and um, keep your energy usage down. Oh, on the uh, electric car? Yeah. Uh, Yeah, I think you did good with that car, Chris. I really do. Mentally, too. It just gives you that extra... Yeah. Because you work hard. You work very, very hard for your money. So, you deserve some. I've been pining over an electric car for 20 years. And you, I'd, and you be, I'd be happy with that electric car driving. You could run. I know. Not enough range. I couldn't even put the plug it in right now. Maybe by summertime. When you went to the dealership, you had no intention of buying a car that day? Nope. We went to get Michelle's Xbox, which we didn't get. <laughs> Is it right? <laughs> yeah, you bought a car on top of it. <laughs> they were actually, when they thought we might get a new car, they were going to toss the Xbox in. But then, because of the problems with your stuff on my credit, they barely got me approved. They actually had to lower the price of the car a little bit more to get me inside the credit window. Wow, wow. And um, so there wasn't... Uh, I even told the guys, like, can you just like, add the cost of the Xbox to load? And just give it to her. <laughs> there wasn't enough left. So there was no excess. And then a month later, I refinanced it and asked for a fraction of the price and saved $5,000. Did you really? Yep. Well, 12% to 4%. That's a big difference. You got all your um, dad stuff off of it? Yeah, got my credit fixed. You need anything, Pop? Nope. Give me a green tea. That's the money. That's for my green tea. Oh, wait a minute. You need some money, too, don't you? Yeah. Why is it so shiny? They uh, waxed it. Who? I had a car wash, then. Thank you. If, all, if you want, as long as you give me the actual cash for whatever you get, you can put your stuff on that card. I'll give him enough money. Well, if he puts it on my card, I get points. <laughs>